birthday peeps the weekend just started so i'm gonna vlog for the weekend and just show y'all everything i'm doing but yeah i'm about to go into the hair store because i gotta do my hair for a brand video yes yes y'all i am doing a brand video so they reached out to me to do some i'm sorry i'm looking at like the whole situation here it's like metal detector type of situation but anyway i'm about to go to the hair store and y'all oh, yeah, i'm listening like y'all probably can't hear me but i'm listening to Des Des Dior. okay let me go in here y'all while i'm sitting out here looking a fool rack it up rack it up i got a bit of the bank to make me a safe house shake it up shake it up she got her hands on her knees and she bringing the cake out smoke it up smoke it up i got some gas some packs i'm up in the greenhouse ball it up ball it up i'm with the game we taking shots off the rebound fucking my post to say now i've been humble too long yeah. tell them all to stay calm yeah. tell them all to move on yeah. fucking my post to say now they be lost in the sauce yeah. took a loss that's your loss yeah. had to get my point across yeah. Okay, y'all. So I'm trying to go into Tip Top Salon. Don't look like nobody in here. It says they're open, I think so. So I should be able to get in and get right out. And that's what I need. So I'm just gonna tell them to cut cut these nails down for my birthday and do a French tip because I don't really trust them to do nothing else. Hello. Can I help you? Um, do you guys have time for a balance? Okay. Hey peeps, so I am out of the nail salon. These are the nails, y'all. These are hot mess. Wait till I get on my actual camera so I can like focus and zoom in to show y'all. I don't know how good y'all can see them right now because my camera is kind of pixelated. Y'all, this is these are a hot ass mess. But I just needed to not look like I needed a balance for my videos tomorrow and um, also I needed them done so I could do my hair easier. I'm gonna start on my hair tonight doing the back. Well actually I'm gonna do I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a little bit of the front just to see how it turns out. This is why I stick to going to 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 black nail techs. But the thing is is that I was thinking while I was in there dang I could have went to like um Cause here's the thing black nail techs don't be working over other people's work and that's the problem um and black nail techs just stay so booked that's the whole issue about why i couldn't go to the nail tech that i went to in the first place honestly like once you book with a black nail tech you have to book your balance the same time you book your full set like that's just what it is but here's the thing i'm not even that mad about it i still tip the lady three dollars so annoying because really i be tipping people really like if you do an okay job or if it costs too much like when something i get with a black nail tech is like 80 90 dollars i'll do a five dollar tip but like if i'm paying like 60 dollars and you do a really 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 good job which only like twice in my life has a nail tech done a really 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 good job and i tipped them ten dollars these nails are such a mess can y'all tell and then she said something to me about glitter and so i was like okay let me get the glitter but i feel like with the glitter it makes me look like 13 y'all this is not okay and in general i already felt like i was 13 because of the the tips and then the way that she did the tips y'all oh my god the way that she did the tips i've never in my life seen a nail tech do such a thing like she put the gel paint on and then she took the brush and then like curved out the tip uh, from she, she curved out the the curve y'all i don't even know how i'm trying to say this but she curved the the tip for the white part so like the curve that you see right here she did that with like a paintbrush the thing is is that we're in quarantine like i mean pandemic people really aren't quarantined anymore but me and my family are so no one's really gonna see this and i just needed to look good enough on camera and for pictures and yeah probably at the end of next week i'm just gonna take these hoes off but anyway just like that getting my nails done and then um the hair store 110 dollars out my pocket right then and there can you believe it can you believe it
I'm sick. <laughs> and then it's just the fact that I really had such a good set with the nail tech that I went to. And it just got ruined. Y'all, these are so ugly. <laughs> I have learned my lesson. I can never not go to a black nail tech again. Oh my God. Okay, peeps. So we are at Walmart. <laughs> So I need to go get paint. Can I even go? Can I go in that way? Or no? I don't know. I feel like I don't see nobody trying to go in that way. But I just saw a lady go out. Okay, maybe you can't go in. I don't know. Let's try. Okay, but I have to get paint. Oh, here it is. Right here. So, here's the paint, y'all. Found it, found it. Okay. Now let's see. Do they have the paint that I'm looking for? Because they told me. They told me that they had it. And I'm really not seeing it though. That's the whole gag. Okay, okay, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. really need them to have this like I really need them to have it look oh my god they have stone they have stone I need this oh it has a textured finish oh my god who would have known not me oh I think I found it I think I found it Okay, so this is the one that I'm gonna get, Ultra Matte. Let's hope and pray that this is gonna be all I need so I can go to my sister's house maybe tomorrow after I film my video. We'll see. And finish my stand, because I need my stuff. Like, it's really crazy that it's taking so long to finish this, mostly because I didn't buy enough paint in the first place. And because I keep ending up at my sister's house when it's dark outside, so. Y'all, I'm watching, oh my, like, okay, when? Okay, that's rude. Um, I'm watching Peyton Marie Charles on YouTube. This wind just got real crazy. Um, but we are about to walk into CVS. To get my sister's Christmas present. Hopefully, this video does not come out before Christmas. And I got my bonnet on because I just, I didn't even um, do my hair before I left like I was supposed to. <laughs> okay y'all so that was a waste of time because they do have it but somehow it's cheaper at target cbs be playing with these prices okay that's why you got a coupon here y'all so i got these two colors for my under eyes it's the elf camo tan neutral and deep olive um some people have mentioned that they like this. Now, one of the YouTubers I saw mention it said that it dries down fast, so we'll see. And then all they have for pro concealer is the suede color and not toffee, which I'm really thinking that this suede color might be too dark. I don't know, I'm gonna get it and try it. It's cheap, so whatever. Um, but I'm also about to get the Macadamia Deep Conditioner. And this is the coarse to coiled mask. So I am about to get this. And I am so happy because I won't be paying for it. This is $36, but y'all, this is what? the only, it's $36. My mom's behind the camera, y'all. Um, but this is the only mask that I feel like works. Like sometimes with a lot of stuff, when it comes to beauty, you pay for what you, you get what you pay for. So this is expensive, but it does what you need it to do. 
versus getting something cheap and just wasting your money. Like, who wants to waste their money? Plus, how long does it last, Amber? Well, it's a mask. You rinse it right out. But it, No. Oh, how, you mean over time? Yes, how long does that jar last? So, it lasts... Um, well, they changed the... Um, the fluid ounces so i'm not sure how long the eight fluid ounces last because i had a bigger one mm. but um it should still last quite a while especially if your hair is short now if you have a lot of hair and you like to put on a lot of product it probably won't last that long and then it also depends how often are you deep conditioning if you're deep conditioning like once a month it'll probably last you three to six months just depending on how much you put on if you're doing it two times a month it should last you at least three-ish months. Uh -huh. If you're putting a lot on, but if you're somebody that likes like literally dime size or quarter size, then you'll be fine. It's gonna last a long time. I kind of low-key want to get a perfume just cause I have, I have $60. I have $60 to spend. So dang, I don't have that much money left if I get this stuff, so. I guess I won't be getting a perfume this time, but I'll be back. <laughs> so we just came out of Ulta. I got my transaction for zero dollars out of my own pocket, because I already have points. So I don't know if you guys can see. Yep, zero, zero, zero. Okay, so one thing that I didn't mention to you guys in my Ulta haul is the fact that when you have the credit card and you shop in the store with the credit card during your birthday month, you get three times the points. The points did not show on my actual um, receipt, but that's because you have to wait for your statement to cut in order to see the points. I don't know why I'm still talking in my mask. Um, so yeah. Whew. You have to wait for your statement to cut for um, your points to reflect the double points because that's all depending on the credit card. So anything reported on a credit card is when the statement cuts. So yeah, and then like with Ulta's points, even though the statement cut on the 5th, it didn't show my actual points tripling until the 11th. So just yesterday yeah so today they were in there and ready for me to spend so i was so happy and so i came down here to go ahead and spend them so yeah that is really such a big factor in getting the credit card is that during your birthday month you should definitely re-up and get everything you need or hold out until your birthday if you just ran out of something if you have the credit card because you can triple your points when you're shopping in store with the credit card I showed y'all everything I got except for the white nail polish. This is the OPI Alpine Snow. So I got this just because I've never had like white toes or white nails or anything like that. But recently there was a situation where I wanted some and I couldn't do it because I didn't have any white nail polish. So got that today for the free. And what that was like $65 worth of products. Hey, I had 67 points. $67 to use in points so yeah so happy okay we're on to the next place we have to go to Nordstrom actually we're gonna go to Target first we're gonna go to Target first um, just to get Christmas gifts and then we're gonna go to Nordstrom and then if we have enough time we are going to come back over here to Nordstrom rack because my mom of course randomly wants to go in there for God knows what whatever <laughs> she's so mad y'all She's so mad. The thing is, is that we have things to do. Damn lights on, Mr. Actually, I need that man to have his lights on because it's, it's giving, it's giving lighting, period. Hey, peeps. So I'm at home now and I just put all my stuff away. I meant to be filming me putting the stuff away so y'all could see, but I forgot. So, oops. But I'm just going to go ahead and go around my kitchen showing y'all what I got and telling y'all like what I got it for pretty much. So let's go ahead and do that. So I got flavored water just so I won't be drinking juice or fiending for juice so much. So this is the Nestle brand, which I've got that before and I know I like the wild berry. But then there was the Ice Mountain brand and that's triple berry so i got that i got some essentia water to you know um keep 
doesn't this like have something about the ph yeah 9.5 ph so trying to get all that into the system um i'm only going to be telling you guys about what i got today so anything else you see in the refrigerator means i already had it um i got another caramel dip because i eat that with my apples i got two more broccoli cheddar soups oh my god i forgot to get extra broccoli okay i have to go to the store to get broccoli so annoying um i got some pineapples to eat in the morning i got this southwest pico de gallo this really isn't the pico de gallo that i like i like the kroger pico de gallo but i was just like let me just make this my one stop so i'm just gonna try and make it do what it do with the southwest meyer pico de gallo um i got a cucumber the cucumber is more so to um put on my eyes so this is more like for beauty i need to lighten up the dark circles around my eye which also means that i need to start going to sleep at a decent time like y'all it's a struggle um i got some maple sausage links um i prefer sausage over bacon and i love stuff that has some type of sweetness to it so i got the maple and I meant to tell y'all that I got the pico de gallo for my eggs in the morning so I can make like an omelet. And let's see here, I got this chorizo. So it's like a sausage, so I'll just have to cut the film off of it and then cook it normally in the skillet. I'm using this to make rotel and I'm trying to make it the same way that D-Era, you know, DK4L D-Era, um, made it in one of her recent videos. So I got pretty much the same things that she got. So she got a Kobe Jack, sharp cheddar, where's my i definitely bought oh wow i don't know where my other cheese went i wonder if i accidentally gave it to my mom because i went to the store with my mom i mean y'all saw that my mom was with me and then i just got mexican cheese because i just love mexican cheese and this is really the cheese that i'm going to also put on my omelets um this is just ground beef right here which i'm also putting in the rotel i got some shrimp because you know, you never know when you want to want some shrimp or need some shrimp. I can make shrimp scampi real quick if I wanted to also with that. And y'all, look at all this ice cream I got. I didn't get this today. I, I had this already, but y'all, I love ice cream. Um, then I got this cracked black pepper beef sausage for my breakfast in the morning. So that's all, all the stuff that I'm going to freeze. Uh, my mom definitely has one of my bags because I just realized that I don't have my Velveeta cheese that's supposed to go on my Rotel. So I'm going to have to go to my mama's house. Um, here are the chips that I got to go with the Rotel. So I got this Taco Bell mild seasoned just to try some a little different. And then I got the regular tortilla rounds. And then I got the ones where you dip. So got those and then y'all saw that I got the caramel to eat with my apples so I got two green apples which I prefer green and then I got this red apple and then I got bananas bananas are more so for me to eat in the morning because they're just super quick I can eat them in the car peel it real quick and easy and then more so my apples are for a snack but I can eat it in the morning but it's really not that quick and easy for me to do so I just eat that like kind of as a light, late night snack where I can eat it with the caramel or peanut butter to have like some sweetness and kind of like give it that candy feel but you know you're still getting some healthiness in with the apple oh yeah and then I got some bread oh my goodness did I end up getting my my mom has like two of my bags y'all oh my gosh um so then I got some bread if y'all saw I had like sandwich meat in there as well as um cheese so cheese slices so I'm making sandwiches and then I have some bratwurst in the freezer already so I got some of these and then I bought some hot dogs I think <laughs> um but yeah so my mom really must have my stuff so I'm gonna call her real quick and be like what do you got she definitely has my Velveeta cheese I got the queso in the regular and then she oh you want to know what there's more bags <laughs> I'm sitting here like naming all the stuff off to y'all like wait that's a lot of stuff 
that's a lot of stuff that I don't have. And I'm like, how did I end up not getting that and giving it to my mother? Like, what? Wait, okay, so I am gonna set y'all up so y'all can see me put this away. I got this coffee. If y'all follow me on Instagram, you would have seen that I drink this coffee and post it like a little thing about it, like a picture, a product picture. Um, here is the Rotel that I got. So yeah, that's what I got. Um, she also put cream cheese in her Rotel. Here are the Velveetas. And she cut hers like up. She didn't use all of it. So I'm going to like freeze these. And um, or I don't even know if you have to freeze them. I don't know. They weren't kept cold in the store. So we'll see. But I got the queso in the original. I got three cans. I got three cans of the Rotel. And I got potatoes so I can make baked potatoes and also so I can make home fries either as you can make home fries for anything breakfast lunch dinner but I need some onions I know I should have got some onions I knew it here is the mozzarella cheese I was missing and then I got two things of chocolate hot chocolate because I drank all my sister's hot chocolate um, at her house so I bought her another one and then I got myself one my mom gave me some hot chocolate but that was trifling so I was like let me just get my own I was trying to save some money by taking hers but it was disgusting so I'm cool with paying the money um yeah so that is everything that i got and i went to meyer so all this stuff is from meyers today and then i'm gonna have to go to kroger to get like the broccoli that i forgot to get and there there was something else i told y'all that i forgot to get but yeah so those will be the things that i have to get at kroger it's just like two or three things i also need to get some more honey from the all natural store that i go to so that's everything y'all um about to just put these actually in their actual like spot and then i got these two alcoholic beverages um i got the stella rosa prosecco because i like prosecco and then um i got this random drink i've never drank this in my life but it was 11 percent and it was a huge bottle for really cheap so i was like hey even if i don't like it at least it'll get me pretty tipsy and it's gonna last long so <laughs> that's all i cared about honestly but i hope that it does taste good because then that just means it's going to be enjoyable and get me a little tired and 